All right, it is another early morning on Saturday. The sun is just starting to rise in the sky. You can see I brought my friend with me, uh, the Shadow, because he's going to be able to do uh, some mining with me. At least he has arms. Say hi, Shadow. There it is. Uh, I also have with me Crazy Bob in the background, although he does not have any arms. Uh, he does make for some good company. It's, it's been a while since I've seen anybody. Uh, and and uh, I gotta be truthful with you. This whole time I've been telling you that it's been this whole virus going around the planet and not being able to see anybody. Uh, but if I'm to level with you, none of the guys ever paid their bill from the first season. If you guys watched YTG season one, you guys know they all got a bill. I was a very good understanding guy last year. I sent them to collections instead of giving them another bill. Not one of those guys ever paid, so I don't know how I'm supposed to make any money when I'm buying all the beer and the lunches if they're not paying their bill. So another dollar I'll make you holler or whatever the new slogan is for you. No, another dollar will make me holler the new slogan for YouTube Gold. Let's see what I did at the mine. What the hell is this? No, 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 no. What are you doing here? You didn't you didn't pay your bill from last year. You can't just show up to the mine expecting to play all day. I heard we were working. For free, maybe. Okay. I'll run to my truck and grab my gear. You better, but stay six feet away well, from me at least. Dude, that's what you get for not paying the bill. Let me out the door. <laughs> and what? You didn't pay your bill. You didn't pay your bill. What are you doing here? You're laughing. I'm the one who shelled out all the money last year and you just decide to show up? You're the one that needs workers. You can't live without us. I, I got Bob and the shadow, bro. Bob, I've seen Bob. You can't even drink a beer. Listen, you can't just be here and not pay your bill, but we've gone through years. You I told feel us to come out. You said that you're lonely and stuff. Okay, so you are on rewiring the pumps because the wiring is that speaker wire? It's the it best kind. It's the, uh, yeah. the best kind of wire. You should be wearing your hard hat, by the way. It is so good to have more people on the mine site. This is the black tarp. We are going to line the pond with. Lyle! Morning, sir. How are you? Welcome! <laughs> Good to see you! I see everyone is showing up for gold today. Straight. Well, okay, well, <laughs> grab a corner of the tarp if you're here. All right. Or, or unless you need your coffee or whatever. I'll fix this tarp. 8 by 10. Yeah, it'll have to stretch lengthwise. As long as it's at least 6 feet. Yeah. A June bug. Look at how big this guy is. Huge. How's that possible? It's May. Water run. Water run. It's trickling out there like you're 60 years old there, sir. Getting there. <laughs> That's a lot of air in the line. There we go. Okay, so we've actually switched over to a 14 gauge wire because what's the point in having a huge battery if we're going to bottleneck it? Speaker wire was a little inadequate. I, mean, I thought I thought here. that's our motto around YouTube yeah, Gold. Perfect for gold. I don't see what the problem is. Inadequacy for the day. Yes. Just get it running. Just get it running. That's right. So now we have a hook on the side where these pumps are actually uh, no longer sitting on the bottom. For those that were watching episode two, you know that I dug this pond extra deep. That's so we could have the silt on the bottom. We'll keep filling it up and then of course it'll pour over into the other one when we have enough flow going on. All the conveyors getting set up. You'll see that safety has moved up on our list. Rookie, your sweater is no longer relevant. Safety is now number 20. On our priority list, yes. Yeah. So Little Red is ready to rock and roll. Just got to get a battery up here. The sluice boxes are back. Where's sluice? Where's sluice? Where's sluice box? Uh, yeah. Well, you're all still drunk on the couch, I think. We're far enough apart. He could be passed out in the camper right now. <laughs> what are you doing? Are you taking off? I'm just making sure everybody's. You, you, you just got here. Feet away. Uh, Eight feet with Joel. Holy crap. Um, Rookie, plug control it in. boxes. Yeah. And we also need some batteries. Ow. Like about 
30 of them. Lyle now doing the all important job of skimming the pool. There is a there is a great method. You can flick that. It's almost like a game. You can see if you can hit Bob or Joe. <laughs> you got him. <laughs> you can do that from way over there. Water off. Way back in the late 90s, early 2000s, I was in the bar, uh, back alley, after Hooters, and uh, I was in an argument with a guy because I told him he looked like Weird Al Yankovic, and he really didn't like that. So we started arguing, and he told me to get on my knees so he could get on his elbows. I said, what? Wait. <laughs> I don't think you meant it like that. And then we became friends. But wait a second. You were in a back alley, and some guy said, get on your knees? <laughs> the back alley. I don't care what back alley. That's... If it's the back alley or whatever. I feel like I've been set up now because he asked me to start the story over while he gets the yeah, camera. That, He's been planning this back alley now. joke for weeks. What did you just say? Where's the marker flag for that tongue of that trailer? Oh, it's yeah. on It's on the end. Trauma trailer. Yeah, it's right here. Oh, oh that's perfect. Oh, okay. That's better now. Yeah. Okay. Better? It's been a long better. winter. Yeah. I didn't see it. Yeah. Hey. Hey. Why didn't you guys tell me I had this on my boot the whole time? Hey. You just let me walk around with that on my boot? Because safety is 20 in it or something. <sighs> safety is 20 in concern. That's true. Priority. Are you putting on your official mining shoes? Yes. These are safety sandals? Are those steel toed? Yep. Yeah. I think those are only legal if, if safety was priority 19. One, one away. So it's 2021, I think that comes in. They're, we're lowering our standards around here, Crazy Joe. Years ago, you would have been furious. I'm wearing shoes. Let's face it, we don't have I don't know if those qualify. <laughs> <laughs> we got a full pond, new battery. New equipment. There's so much equipment and like three operators. So you're going to have to run multiple pieces today. Okay, I think I can uh, handle a couple of pieces. Rookie, He's gonna work you got to work two hoes at the same time. I can work two hoes. I supply a uh, rookie with uh, lubricant. You what? No. I supply Rookie with no. lubricant for his hose. Lubricant? What's that? God, you're being picky today. Oh my God. <laughs> I am just trying to be you, Lyle. Oh God, he's reach higher. Are we ready to uh, mine some gold, boys? Oh yeah. Crazy Joe, fire up that generator. All right, here we go. Oh, hey. What? Hey, what? Pull start it. Was it dodging? You're married. You should be plenty strong. Three tugs. Four tugs, five tugs. Are you kidding? Is there any gas in there? You got to turn it on to the run position. It is on the run position. <laughs> oh. Nice. Extra gas. Oh, that sounded close. Two pulls, eh? Hey? We should jump. <laughs> I'd have to jump it. <laughs> Why would I? Okay. <laughs> I didn't help. I hate this. It's not even starting. Now pull it. Now it'll fire right up. I warmed Don't it up for you. <laughs> we we could just use the battery and plug it in. Slowing us down. Nickel holding up a dollar. Close enough! Oh. You're about to the road! Oh, oh stop! You're like four feet away! Is that Are the you... road on that tire? <clears throat> oh no! <sighs> Bring in some real Ford power here to start up the generator. I offered for these boys to pull up their trucks. What do you drive there? Chevy, right? That's right. Dodge? Both of you guys Dodge. said no. I didn't say no. <laughs> Obviously, Mine's there's the Ford. In. Well, we may no, as well use not. the owner's <laughs> Ford, <laughs> Ford jumping a high on day. Well, that's totally disconnected. Why is that disconnected? Well, because that battery's, that, that battery's dead, is completely dead. She's yeah. in there for weight. Is, yeah, that's exactly it. How did you know that? Logic. Yeah. How much shit do you have plugged into that battery? No <laughs> you go ahead. Well, that was easy. That was way easy. I don't know why you couldn't pull start it. Ford power, baby. Water on! Water on! Yeah! Oh yeah, you got some water you got some there. there, eh? Hey, we could 
use some that we could that's proper way we should have it up at the top there we get this thing shaking that's amazing yes what about the other one fire up the other one firing up the other one boy you can hear it already oh yeah number yeah. one number two look at the water Dude, that's success right off the bat. How often have we had both both pumps working at the, at the same time? The we need to level this one a little bit. Yeah, I need the uh, stick of leveling. Hmm. Need a leveling stick. There you go. Perfect. Remember, for every 12 inches of sluice box, you need one inch of drop. Okay. Yeah, we're near there. Two inches of drop total. Just, I'm just focused on uh, checking out what's going on with the pumps here. Seeing the water starting to come down through the big pipe. So explain what we're seeing here. The water, how's the water so going in up there? We're seeing the water being pumped here by these two new pumps and that pump over yonder. And coming out over here in our oh. sluices where the mat's floating away. Speaking of a mat, yes, thank you. Into our reservoir there, which drops through our pipe here. In the ground. Back into our holding pond here. So a recirculating pond. That's right. You can really tell when Sluice Fox Steve isn't here. Normally both of these mats would be sliding out. No, we only, uh, oh no, no, that's, this one is. Oh, is it? Yeah, it yeah, is too. It's working its way down. That's because we got so much water. It's I so know, that's water. great flow. Yeah. Need more wood. That's the, mo that's the most flow we've had off of those sluices. I thought Lyle was pissing there for a second when I turned around. <laughs> I'm like, why are you pissing in the pond, bro? You gotta add to it no matter what. The pond's your fork. Remember, all water is urine. It's just been evaporated and then re-rained. Oh, I see. Makes sense. Too cloudy and dirty when it gets back here to be pumped back through. If it's cloudy and dirty, Lyle should go to the doctor. That's probably a good idea, yeah. The flow off of that pan is amazing. Can you fire up that trommel? Does it work? Somebody give it a flick of the switch. Which dozer's number one and which one's number two? Everything's going good on the trommel. Payday! Lyle, sir? we need you to cut a road as fast as possible, sir. I may send Joe up there with the loader to try to help clear out that area. Okay. Right down the center, man. Try to rip a road. Yes, with this one, it's pump on all the time, but you don't have to ask me always. Bob's standing right here. So he's going to start cutting his way down the middle. Crazy Joe's going to come the other way and also start cutting his way up towards Lyle. That way we can get a road going straight through, just wide enough for the excavator. I know on the other side of where Joe was working, we had a small pile of pay that was left that we didn't get to last year. It's covered with the rubber. Okay. Could you take uh, whatever loader, excavator, whatever, and a rock truck, fill it full of pay, because that's the last we have until they get this road open. You bet. Bring it up here and let's get some dirt moving. I can do that. Thank you. Joe getting push fed, getting all that overburden out of the way, trying to make the road for the excavator. So this is your first time with this Komatsu? Yes it is. Yes. 
Outside of Loading Kings. Outside of Loading Kings. I'd like to take a moment just to shout out to our sponsor, Loading Kings, uh, presented to you by RC Sparks Reboot on YouTube. Uh, they have done a lot for us, helping making YouTube Gold even possible for you guys. Uh, shout out to the guys that helped make that happen. And uh, if you haven't seen it yet, go check out Loading Kings right now. Rookie? What hoe do you want me to work first? Oh, uh, it's totally your choice, bro. You can do whichever hoe you want. I'm gonna take the blue hoe. Never used the blue hoe. Very Captain Kirk of you. Very much so, yes. Now we have a driver on the inside representing Rookie. On the side, there you go. Down Great. she goes. Very nice. Got me some pay. Is that all there was? It's all there was for now. I'm waiting on the boys. These roads are a little skinny. They're beautiful, but they're a little skinny. You know what? You got to bring the excavator down here. Can you track it down? Yeah, it's going to take me a while. Yeah, that's, a, that's what we need down here though. <laughs> We're never going to make any money around here. Oh no. There was another film crew around here, but I think I may have buried them alive. <laughs> what do you mean? It's just... There was another film crew over there somewhere on the other side. Oh no! Where'd it go? There you go, how's that? That's perfect. And here it comes. Down the narrow road. making its way towards the site. Almost like a professional did that. Come on boys, the excavator's here already. Lyle, keep, push it down, man. Just I thought he was going to drag it down. Push it straight down. Okay, if you can just turn around and rip that and take it with you. Okay. We don't need the pad protecting it there anymore. It, that mat is old. Yeah, drag her forward. There you go. Now curl it in. And you should be able to lift it up a little bit when you curl. There you go. Good job, man. Oh, the excavator's in the way. You gotta wait, he's pulling out the mat. So we were using this mat to protect the site from rain. Rookie making his way up the steep embankment. Lots of equipment moving around. Here comes the rock truck. Six wheel drive making its way up there. Rock truck weighs at least 45, 48 pounds by itself. Good to rock and roll, dudes. Let's get that pay. Hey, Too turn much the water. water. Up. Shut off. Damn, Kevin. He's always Kevin? things up. I told to Kevin to watch the pump. Come on. Crazy Joe. Yo. I think the hose is far too long because the pump seems to not give us enough pressure at the top of the water with the bars there. I think we need to cut that pipe shorter and remove like four feet of hose. Are you, you used to working with big hoses? You keep 
keep talking about your host. Well, uh, you can me compliment nervous. me. Thank you for the compliment. Beautiful. I don't know, Rook. Didn't take you long, buddy. Okay, Lyle, you look ready to rock, dude. First load of fresh pay. For a second, I thought that was crazy, Bob. But you just had your arms folded. Yeah. Not far behind. What a machine, Miles. Joe's ready to rock and roll. First scoop of the season, boys. Woo! Bring on the gold. Yeehaw! Last year, people wanted to see, <laughs> wanted to see the dump truck dumping into the hopper. We did that. It overloaded the hopper. We know that there's a certain capacity for these machines. Here it goes. Yeah! Are these back far enough? Yes, they are! First dirt coming in! We're washing dirt, boys! Yeah! So Rookie's having to add some hydraulic fluid to the Cabelco. Trying. Don't know what's going on. Got out the hydraulic fluid though. Good, good uh, five liters. I don't think it'll take all that, but. No, not all of it. Just gonna control the flow coming from the hopper a little bit more. That way he can keep it in there full, keep a constant rate in that trommel. Sounds like you could use a little lubrication in there, Rook. Such great machines. Continuing to work away. Very windy today. Good job, Lyle! Crazy Joe starting in with the big bucket full. Rookie now switching off. Whose beer is on top of the electrical container? It's fine, I'm standing here. It's on top of an electrical container. It's okay, it's beer. It's fine. It's totally fine. And the conveyors spin around and around. Drinking and mining. Mining and drinking. They kind of go hand in hand. Nice. 
Here we go, I'm gonna wrap it up. Shake away, baby. Joe, shut it down. Shut it down. Lyle, sure. I need you to cut some hose off of the pump there. We got way too much hose going. We have to push way too much water. So yeah, could you take this hose and figure out how much hose we can cut off? There's way too much length there. Yeah. You're not in this business? You're, no, HVAC, you're not a hose toucher? Furnaces and air conditioning and whatnot. Isn't that all the same? No. That was quick and easy. Thank you. Lyle with a professional installation there. Rookie. Sir. Hey, you're too close to Bob. Hey, Bob's, Bob's too close object. to you. Good. You getting it? No. Okay, good job. I don't know, Crazy Joe, I feel like we're slipping. I had to send everybody inside to get a beer. There should be beer out here already. It feels good to be back. Maybe they just don't remember. Of course, I'm the one always complaining about the cost of beer. No one ever brings any beer, do they? I did bring beer once, I think. <laughs> what are you doing? Put him in the sun. Joe, come over here you now so the sun is in the front. I agree. Work it. I like how the hair blows together in the wind. <laughs> See? Coming with the articulating Volvo. I anticipated a huge crew this year, brought in tons of equipment after watching Todd Hoffman bring in tons of equipment on his show. Up in Canada, we just got season three. We wish him luck. More equipment means more gold, but not when I don't have the people to run it. Nice job, Lyle. Perfect. Getting your practice in, dude. Oh, yeah. Yeah. I'll drive it off the edge. I'll try not to. <laughs> oh. Sorry, I have no idea what I'm doing. You're getting much better at this, though. Oh, it's smooth as butter. What happened? Yeah. It's jammed? Yeah. Like space balls jammed? Yes. Run it in reverse. Turn it off. Shut her down. First thing you do when it's jammed is shut it off. Okay, you gotta reverse the polarity somehow by crossing the streams. No cross the streams. I might have gotten That's that wrong. in the movie. We don't do that. Everything I see on TV is true. Shut her down. Shut her down. Shut her down. Shut her down! My shadow is now behind me. I had more help than just my shadow today. Woo! YouTube gold, baby! YouTube gold! YouTube gold! Gold! No, it's YouTube, it's YouTube gold. YouTube gold. You had it stacked up that high? You should have been running less pay. 
Yeah, must have got a rock and a roller or something. I think we might have some gold today. I freaking hope so. I've been waiting for this day forever. I think we're good. Pumps down. Pumps down. Trommel up. Oh, I see some nougats. Trommel off. I see some I shine. see quite a few nougats I up there. Oh. oh, look at this. What's that? What's that? Nice. What's that? YouTube gold, baby. Finally What's back that? in business. Look at that. Look at this. You're in the shadow. There it is. <laughs> I wasn't even pointing at it with the camera. <laughs> Hell yeah! You guys don't know this, but I got you all special cleanup suits this year. Woo! You're gonna love it. Well, I think they will. He's able to get out these sluice boxes, working as a team. This way they're not going to get any black sand on them, any of the pond water. You can see that they can clearly see each other. I can't believe Crazy Joe is actually getting on board this year with the high vis. Struggling in the rubber gloves, I think. It's like a race. Everything's sriracha, guys. And I win, bitch. I can't. Oh, he wins. KJ. Still working at it. Gloves. He's got it. I win. I got the most gold. Who wins now, bitch? It's in. Who wins now, bitch? Yeah, damn, man. Eh? Holy shit. Ah, Look I at that. Ya. God damn! Beautiful! Okay, I got some water ready. Hold on. Oh, oh God. That's probably not a good idea to burp in your house, bud. Pull that mat sideways. Going down into the classifiers. Look at that beauty right there. That's gorgeous. With all of them wearing masks, I don't have to wear one. This is a bonus. Sorry guys. No, you're not. No, I'm not. It's hot today. It's extra hot today. It's unusually hot for YouTube Gold today. I'm really trying hard not to pass out. <laughs> yeah, that's definitely out. Quarter, yeah, yeah. quarter inch, yeah. Thin and all the pea gravel. This is where we found it. Beautiful, I see color in there. Oh, I see all sorts, man. Freaking beautiful. Okay. That's good, water off. Water off. Okay, and onto the gold table. Water on! Water on. Water's on. Wasn't sure if you could hear me there. I know, I have to repeat, that's part of the reason. I hear me really good. Yeah, that comes a lot in there. What? You guys are going to be able to see the gold so much better on the table. Joe, you ready to sweep some gold even though we're not supposed to even touch this table? Practicing. Yeah. Rookster? Okay, on your... Get, hey, I don't want to give you a penalty, man. On your I'm X. On your X. Hey! I'm extra safe. Extra safe. Nice. I like that. It's not even a gold joke, but it applies. Water. Water on! Water! Water's on! Shaker on! Filled right over the edge of the table. Hey, it's good to see the old girl fired up. Woo! Go. Yeah, you two gold. Nice. Right. Are we ready? I think so. I'm Here, this is. Yeah. yeah. I gotta find my X. On your X's. Good luck to the gold. Gold.
Gold, 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 gold. Heck yeah. <laughs> Very nice. That's nice to see against the green you know, instead of the know, instead what? of the white. There it is. Yeah, right there. Nice. I love the flow of the table so far. It looks nice and level. Well, the way it's supposed to be. These guys being extra careful. We want to maintain visibility while we're cleaning up the gold. Yeah, Did you just say absolutely? I did say absolutely. Shout out to Wyatt. Woo. How's it going, Wyatt? We know you're watching right now, buddy. Yeah. Oh, that's a nice oh, look concentration. At look at that. So how many yards today? Like uh, half yard? I was going to say a quarter, but maybe a half. That's what I get for, for uh, continually cleaning the snow off my driveway and putting it into a pile. A whole pile of dirt to yeah, dig in. Yeah, we might have had that half a yard. It's amazing how, much, how you get the, uh, the gold out of after snow. You know what it is? Is because I think the earth, it, it pushes it up to the top in the frost as the water yeah. in the ground, yeah, nice. it pushes the heavier stuff like rocks up to the top and I'm able to scrape it off. Everybody knows that in Alberta. That yeah, totally absolutely. sounds totally how you very get gold. feasible. Well, it's like how well, you I'm get like good size time. gold, right? How, what do you think, Lyle? What do you think? Look good? What's that? I'm just happy to be back floating color down Yeah, the you too gold, man. There you go. Hey, there's some black sand. Ugh. Good thing I was wearing a hard hat. I know, it just hit me right in the head. <laughs> they always laugh at us because we wear hard hats, like hey, we're idiots. Did you just see that accident? <laughs> you know what could have happened? So Crazy Joe, if you guys have never seen this before, this is a, a concentration table which helps break down a lot of the pay that we're going to put into the Wheel of Fortune. It gets rid of all this like lighter stuff and keeps all the heaviest sand and heavy gold floating towards the uh, container that Joe's holding. That's and if right. he misses it, it goes into a bucket down on the far side which all that pay can be processed as well. And that's all the tailings that go in here that run into this trough. Sorry, Lyle, I'm not listening, buddy. I'm okay. watching the gold. There it is, the concentrate of concentrates. Let him zoom. Yeah, that's nice. I love it. Shall we fire up the wheel? I don't see any gold in there, actually. <laughs> Shall we fire up the wheel of fortune? Well, you will see some gold in here. Let's do it. You can't get close enough. I can. It's I can. Right there. There. Uh, your gloves in the way. Yes, sir. I said right there. Yes, sir. So now that we've got all the, those uh, lighter but larger rocks in, right? off of the table, yes. yes. Now yes. this will actually sift through the sand. Well, hold on. We got to make sure that it's going to carry it up. Let's make sure we got the right angle. It's been, been a long time since we use this. Oh yeah, there's gold climbing oh, already. Oh, there's one there. Yep. Bloop. So and our angle seems watch. to be okay. Finally, after all this time, gold going in the wheel. This wheel seems far too small. But good for what we have. It's hard to operate with these damn gloves. I see that. Well, I got I'm like a death grip you've, on the spoon. Gone, oh, there's some. Nice, that's a good piece. Gold's still climbing. That, that's all we care. I don't see anything now but black. I'm staying right about here. I agree. Not really going up any further. Okay, boys. First gold. Yeah, I'll slide the pan towards you. Yeah. Oh, do we need to rewash it? Is there quite a bit in there? Is it sandy? Oh, nice Hold on, let's rewash it. We uh, always rewash it. I forgot. Sandy. Is it not sandy? Oh, let's do it then. Drop her in there. Let's see what we got. Dude, look yeah. at that. Pick her look in the corner. It. Woo! Dude, that's, yeah, that's, go, that's, that, that's a lot of gold for the amount of dirt that we actually moved today. People are going to say, is that real gold? I should get a gold tester here. Yes, it's real gold. Yes, it's real gold. How do you test gold? 
You can do some acid tests and you can hey, you can like eat it. Test yeah, put it in some gold schlager, yeah. right? If yeah. it reacts, then you know you got good gold. I need to turn it up to hot. Great job, boss. <laughs> this Revlon's been kicking ass for years. Okay, boys, have a look. Shall we weigh her up? Joe, you go first. Crazy Joe. I'll come and have a look. Ooh, nice. Got a guess on how much? I'm gonna say eight grams. You're definitely a gold miner. You've been in the business a long time. <laughs> I'm, I'm only gonna go six grams though. There's, a lot of this stuff is super thin. Lyle? I go at 5.9. 5.9 grams, you didn't even look at it. Don't need to. All right, boys, I made sure to clean off my scale so there was no evidence of anything. We can fire it up and see how many OZT we have of gold. Look at that. So nice. Bring it in. Come bring on, it in. Bring it in. Bring eight. it in. Eight. Bring it in. Look at this. Point. I got point 0.2, right. .5. I got point, oh, point 0.1. This is on OZT. I should put it on grams. It should be on grams. It should be on the grams. I was really hopeful for ounces. I got nothing there. I got one point. Grab the piece that you see that spilled. There's one on the right container there. and there's one to the lower How left. How nice of the that is, hey? Lower left, somewhere in there. Okay, so uh, mode. How many grams? How many grams? How many grams? Eight grams. Eight grams. Eight grams. Here 4 point eight. Lyle was close. Lyle was the closest. Lyle. Lyle. Yes. So. I don't know how many weekends we have left of gold because we started so late. I kind of feel like we just got, got started, yeah? Yeah, yeah. We did just get started. So, I, so uh, I don't even know what our, what our season goal is supposed to be. It's a month and a half into gold and we haven't even started. And uh, can we dress up in suits like this all the time? No. It's too hot in the summer. Yes. Hats together, boys. Throw them in the middle on three. One, two, three, YouTube gold. <laughs> right on. Remember, you guys are being charged for your PPE. The right. suit alone was over $150 each, so for you right. guys, 200 bucks just because I'm giving you a friend discount. It's just a deposit, though. We can, turn, we can return it, right? After it's, it's once it's used, it's a one-time use only. You have a new one each time you're here. I'll add it to your bill.